Hello, and welcome to our channel. Today we'll be addressing a common issue faced by Panasonic TV owners, being stuck on one channel. If you're experiencing this problem, don't worry, we've got you covered. We'll walk you through some simple troubleshooting steps to help you resolve this issue and get back to enjoying your favorite shows. So let's get started. Before we dive into the solutions, let's quickly go over some common reasons why your Panasonic TV may be stuck on one channel. This could be due to a variety of factors, such as a remote control issue, a software glitch, or a simple technical hiccup. Now let's move on to the solutions. One of the first things you can try is power cycling your TV. Simply unplug your TV's power cable from the wall outlet and hold the power button for a few seconds. Then plug it back in and turn it on. This can help reset the TV and resolve minor issues. Ensure that your remote control is functioning properly. Replace the batteries and check for any stuck buttons. Sometimes a malfunctioning remote can cause the TV to be unresponsive to channel changes. Another solution is to reset the TV's software. To do this, unplug the TV from the mains for about 30 seconds, then plug it back in and turn it on. This simple step can often fix the problem. If the issue persists, you can consider performing a factory reset on your TV. This will restore the TV to its original settings and can help eliminate any software-related issues. However, keep in mind that a factory reset will erase all your customized settings and data, so use this option as a last resort. If none of the above steps work, it's possible that there may be a hardware issue with your TV. In this case, it's best to contact a professional technician or the manufacturer for further assistance. Hopefully, by following these troubleshooting steps, you've been able to resolve the issue of your Panasonic TV being stuck on one channel. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and tutorials. If you have any questions or if there's a topic you'd like us to cover in our future videos, feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.